Hello, this is Zoe <laughs> again. I went to save all this and mucked it up a little bit so you might see a few circles opening and shutting. My editing is a bit up the haywire crazy today. But anyway, um, it's it's a nice short video, so have a look. And um, I'm going to film the Taco Girls later. Okay, just explaining why you might hear things repeated. Well, not a lot, but you know, <laughs> you'll get it when you see what I what I did. <laughs> Hello. Uh, okay, just joining a few together. I'm actually going to do another one tonight because I've got my little girls taco night. So um, I want you to meet some new people and. We'll talk about 100 day challenge uh, first up I'm going to show you my girlfriend Nikki who she's just one of my best friends so I wanted to show you her then I'll pop back and introduce you oh no then the next clip is Paul with um, her little baby and it's very cute and then um, watch <laughs> okay now this okay now this is Nikki Hi. <laughs> And I, Nikki was the one who last uh, a few times ago sang that, you know, what did you sing? Uh, Come on, baby, light my fire. Oh, that's it, yeah. A while oh, ago. There, there, there you are. So there she is. Hi. And Nikki is responsible for my hair. Nikki is a fabulous hair and makeup artist and does lots of celebrity hair and makeup too. <laughs> and she recently did, which I think is highly funny because he hasn't got much hair, but she recently did Billy Crystal's hair and makeup when he was in Australia. I did I was very excited. I was yes. jealous. I wanted to go. No, good I wasn't man. jealous. Very I was very man. excited for her. So I love all that. So there's Zoe. What are you doing? I was always taking pictures oh, of Paul with this. Ella. That's They're in that's... watching the football. I don't know if you can oh, see. You can't see that. <laughs> 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 I think I'm... Look how cute it is. So See, have everyone. you got a goal for 100 days? You might as well say okay, something. Okay, well, I thought about it, and because I'm, I am carrying a little bit of cuddly excess, I am going to lose six kilo oh, in good 100 days. And um, also do sit-ups when I get tired rather than go for a glass of wine. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, Nikki which I'm not drinking. I'm not drinking for the next three weeks. Yeah. I've said it out um, loud now. I, I'm so not I'm drinking, not but I, I must admit I did enjoy one every now and then. Um, I drank a whole bottle of champagne with Sandy the other night, which was on here. You can ooh, even see me. Oh, that'll be fun. And um, back back to work. And so my 100-day challenge is to get all my clients sorted on a Monday, Wednesday and Friday, which I've missed. And they've right. missed me too, which is That's good. That's right. Where are and these? back into doing all my weddings, all my brides. So that's what I... that's to get focused on all that again. So we'll film her and see if she's done this. You should come on, on a shoot. I, I did a shoot in the um, Stoke House, 7 o'clock in the morning at down the beach. Who did you do? Um, I did shoot the chef and it was amazing. So there yeah, we are. Maybe you guys come on a shoot. <laughs> we'll do a makeover. We should do a before and after on you. There you go. Oh, Fred, I've already given them the spray tan. I did a before and after oh, spray tan the see other everyone. day. Goodbye. <laughs> This is making me very clucky, I have to say, because Paul is sitting here watching the football with Ella. It is very cute. Yeah. I haven't seen him doing that for a long time, so it made me think, oh, maybe I'd like another one. <laughs> watching the footy. How cute is that? Zoe, do you want me to have another baby? Why not? I like Ella. Because I'm the baby. <laughs> I just found this next little bit on my camera. Zoe must have been wanting to do an YouTube thing, so have a look because it's very funny. She's introducing herself into her dance, so I'll make sure she does that tonight. Um, and I loved what she just said in the past clip because I always say to her, Zoe, Zoe, don't you want me to have another baby? And she goes, no, I'm your baby. So it was very cute to get her actually saying that. Okay, uh, next is, oh, my mum and dad. I wanted you all to meet my mum and dad because a lot of people have asked me about my mum because she was the one who used to have Desiderata, which is one of my prior entries, talking about this amazing uh, piece of writing that I read and read over and over for years when I was a kid, and I think that's how I think now. Anyway, so here's my mother, the instigator of putting it on the bathroom wall so that we all saw it daily, or more than once daily, really. So here we go. Okay, so I'm going to show you a little sneak peek of my dance. I haven't done very much yet, but this is may, might be the little bit that I'm going to teach you. Alright, here you go. Oh, it's called Show Me The Money by Pete, um, Pete Pablo, and it's from Step Up. Okay. 
Let's really step up. Okay. Okay, I think I'm recording. The doorbell's just gone and my mum and daddy here and they will be so camera phobic so I'm filming them. Is it filming? Okay, so here they are. Mum and dad. Hello. Okay, this is my mum and dad here. <laughs> who are going to be on YouTube. <laughs> and everyone has wanted to see mum because she was the one who put desiderata. Oh, oh. There we are. And oh. there's dad. So Beautiful we'll take desiderata. Okay. Okay, I had dinner on the weekend at a fantastic restaurant called Rock Pool in Melbourne. If you ever come to Melbourne or Sydney, there's one there as well. Beautiful, beautiful food. Uh, the mere fact that they took a very long time to get us that entree was uh, okay, because when it came, it was delicious. Um, but just looking out the windows, they've got these fantastic big fiery things that when the casino opened, they used to do them like every five minutes or so, but um, I think it got very expensive. So now they just do them every hour on the hour. So I filmed that. And then, um, as we were walking back to the car, we thought, oh my God, we've probably got a ticket because we had parked illegally. And then we didn't, so uh, you'll see that. And uh, then I'll finish off, just a little short one for now, and then I'll film everyone later. Have a happy day, everyone. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Bye. Okay, we're at the casino and this is at a restaurant called Rockpool and I'm actually looking through the blinds and there's these big uh, things that explode with fire every hour on the hour. I don't know if they can do it again. Maybe. But um, I think you just saw it a minute ago. You can see light going up in other places. I'll get a picture of our friends. Oh, is it going to come up? No. It is exactly, but it's very dull in here. I'm making a decent one out. Hello, I'm back again. I can't get... I don't think they're doing anything. There we go, there was another one. Yeah, they're very aggressive. So that's Melbourne City out there in the background. We are walking back to our car and we have been highly illegally parked so if we don't have a ticket it'll be amazing it's a secret. <laughs> let's have a look here is the car walking up in melbourne have we got a ticket be careful of the cars yeah. no ticket but we're getting run over in the process Dandala. no ticket <laughs>